This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics in Tucson, Arizona. We're selling this Infinity. It is a 2012 Infinity QX56. It's four wheel drive. Um, it's loaded. Uh, it has 128,657 miles. Um, it was a trade in to the Chapman New Car Dealership Group in Scottsdale. And it's a beautiful car, really beautiful. Um, we brought it here, we scanned it, it said it needed a new valve timing actuator, which we did. Turns out that's one of their what, issues that they have and new ones are important. So it's a very important fix. We did an oil change, we did an air filter, and we did a detail. Other than that, it's exactly the way we bought it. I'll walk around, I'll show you the thing. This, this uh, SUV will roll around it real quick. We've got 22s is what it comes on. I'd say they're probably 50% treads. You probably got 10,000 miles left in them. You got some high speed rock chip stuff going on here, but nothing major. If you want to spend a half an hour with some touch up paint, you could deal with that. Front camera, right? walk around and I'll be talking to you about this thing and basically my job here isn't to sell this vehicle it's to uh, present everything that I know about it everything that my shop knows about it I'll be showing you the Kelly Blue Book I'll show you the uh, Carfax everything that we know about this you will know all right that way see what I mean a little touch-up little door dings all along here take you five minutes and those would disappear um, everything we know about this vehicle you're gonna know that way there's no uh there's no drama drama doesn't work well first thing that's interesting about this vehicle is the following i was wondering what was going on until i, I did the uh, research this is the center console that goes there okay why isn't it there there are the brackets for it right here right which might make a little noise when we go on our drive but there they are well it turns out that there's also a mat that goes in between so what they do is they give you an option you can take this out leave it in your carport or you can put it in with it out you can walk in between the back seat and the in the front seat without stepping over stuff if you do put this in that's what this mat's for this mat will go behind it in front of the third row okay there you go and the electric seats obviously they'll go all the way forward and back i got them tilted all the way back so relaxing setting right that's that. All right, I hit this. Little rock chip right there. Pretty car. You got these things brand new, are a fortune. We have a 2019 Armada Platinum over there that sold for 66,000 brand new. And uh, this is a lot more car than that. All right, let me start this guy up. All right, 128,675 miles. Let's go under the hood here. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There's that. All right, there you go. Not much to look at other than it looks great. You got the stickers where they belong, right? It's all original parts up here. You got a, you even got an Infinity battery still in it. There you go. That was boring, but that's good. Boring's good oh, when I'm doing this. I like boring. All right, first stop, Kelly Blue Book. I think it's really low, by the way, on this, but it is what it is. Uh, QX56 Sport with 128,000 miles. Uh, range is 16.5 to 19.2 with a typical listing price of 18.589. Here is the uh, this down here. Here is the uh, Carfax. Okay. No accidents reported. Uh, bu -bu -bu. They said damage. I'm going to show you that in a second. I don't know what happened, but I can't find it. Good uh, title. No major title title problems uh, were found. And Infinity of Scottsdale. And then it was Infinity of Peoria. Getting serviced very regularly. 
ba, 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 ba. then they sold it ba, 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 ba. great services happening all the way along the road here Bang. Boy, they took this thing to the shop all the time. That's probably why it's a nice car. So it says, uh, this is, my guy's right, nice. Sway bar bushing, suspension serviced, oil and filter, differential serviced. And then uh, at 128.6, they decarbon the motor, which is very good. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. 128, serviced it. And then here, BMW, Camelback, they sold it to Wheel Kinetics, okay? Here is the title. This is with the trade in title, the, the dealer there. Colleen from Queen Creek, there's the VIN, okay? She traded it in. Colleen traded it in to BMW, Chapman BMW uh, and Camelback. Let's see, and then they, Camelback, sold to wheel kinetics with 128,657 miles okay now you've seen the paperwork get all that boring stuff out of the way there's your manual seat forward back forward back up down I kind of got a hurry here there's so many bells and whistles that I got to get through here that talking actually slows me down here. all right window like I said, underneath this thing, there's little bracket holes. See these holes right here? That's where that center console would go if you wanted it. All right, let's see, you got heated seats, high and low. Definitely don't want those today, it's 100. You got, uh, let's see, auto, ba ba ba, that's the, uh, turn the fan up back here. Turn the temperature down back here. That's what we want. And there you go, there's the air blowing cold. Boom. Pretty car, super pretty. You got uh, headrest. Uh, uh, I'm not sure how these things work, by the way. I don't know if you have to plug a unit into this to play these. I'm not sure if there's like a, if they, punch out I don't know what they do that'll be for you to figure out uh, when it comes to DVDs and audio stuff I suck <laughs> so I always tell people if, they, if audio stuff has a problem go to Best Buy it's like half the money there um, but I doubt it I just don't know how to do it that's all forward back up down tilt forward back Let's see, you got the tailgate. Here's the opener back there, right? All right, and then I'm gonna hit it again. Let's see, to close it. Now it's closing, right? Okay. All right, let's see. And then, what else we got here? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, this is, what is this thing? I forget what this is. Oh yeah, that's the mirrors. See the mirrors out and in? And let's see what else we got going on here. Let me hop in here. There's your tilt wheel up and down, out and in. All right, let's see, air's blowing cold. Let's see, ba -ba -ba. map. We already have the map up there. Boom. See, change the get the volume up. The steering. Change the station. For example. All right. So that's that. Let's see. Let me see. How do you work this? Oh, there you go. Push. All right. There's that. Boom. Let's see, what else we got? Windshield wipers. Let's see, cruise control. There's cruise on and off. I'll put it in neutral. Put it in neutral. Then we're going to go to 
four low. Now we're in four low. Traction control goes off when you're in four low. Put it in drive. Put it in reverse. There's your backup camera, by the way. All right, neutral. Now we're gonna go to four high. Now we're in four high. Traction control comes back on when you're in four high. That's drive and reverse. Neutral. Now we're gonna go back to auto. All right. Oh wait, I don't have to push there. You can just go, go like this. You don't have to push, go like that. Uh, let's see, you have heated seats in the front, heated steering wheel. Boom, boom, boom. These things fold seats, I think. Oh, look. Huh. Now watch this one. Now this is this one. Boom. There you go. Uh, let's see, what else? Let's go for a ride. All right. If you come to Tucson to drive this thing home, you will pay the following. You will pay your state tax rate, whatever that is, plus our city tax of 2.7% and a $250 dock fee. Um, if you uh, pay by wire and ship out of Arizona, all you're gonna pay is agreed upon price. There'll be no tax, no dock fee, nothing. Once we receive your payment by wire, we will fill out the title with your name or your company's name and address. We will uh, sign it off to you, we will scan it in your online file, and we will mail it to you. We'll even scan in the envelope we mail it in. Um, you will have the vehicle shipped to you. You already have the title in the mail long before it shows up. And uh, once the vehicle shows up by your shipper, you'll take the title you have and go get plates. It's simple. If you need help with shipping, let us know at the time of the transaction, and we will be glad to uh, help you. We can either roll the, uh, uh, the uh, shipping into the price of the vehicle if you need that for your loan or if you want us to. Uh, we could do the shipping for you, or you could do it yourself. Um, we have people who have bought many, many cars from us over and over, and they've kind of learned how to do it, and so they do it. A lot of people like us to do it because uh, they know what these shippers are like. <laughs> They'll tell you they're coming on Monday, and they're going to pick drop it off on Tuesday, and they show up on Wednesday and drop it off on Saturday. And uh, it's really, sometimes it can be annoying. So knowing the right guys to call really does matter sometimes. Um, Anyway, I think that's about it. Um, let's see. Deposit, 500 bucks. Once we have a deposit, we have a deal. Until then, it will stay for sale. So please make sure you get your deposit in. Uh, last part of every video, I say the same thing every time and I have for 13 years. Last two or three minutes of any video you'll ever watch uh, with me in it, I'll say this. We don't have salesmen. We don't have bottled water with our name on it. We don't have a lounge to hang out in. We don't have a fancy parking lot and fountains and, you know, all that stuff. We don't have scones and a game room. They got all that crap a half a mile east of here. And uh, you're paying for it every time you buy a car over there. All right. You're also paying for future repairs when you buy a car over there at the auto mall. Um, they know that if they sold you this vehicle and it broke, that uh, you would uh, expect them to fix it. So trust me, they will ask you uh, for more money and they will get more money from you which is why you're paying so much for it um, to uh, fix it in the future uh, so they charge you for that up front um, if you came in and uh, you said oh the window doesn't work or the you know whatever doesn't work uh, they have about 600 bucks in it for future repairs if it was more than that then 600 say it was a thousand bucks they'd say screw it just give them their money back and we'll sell it to somebody else that's what they do okay that's how that works um, if it's under 600, they'll fix it and you'll keep it. But either way, you already paid for it or you don't get your car. So that's, that's how they do it, okay? Uh, we don't do that because we're not fixing your car. We're you're saving a thousands of dollars, several thousand dollars in this case, um, because you're buying it from us and we don't have any of that crap and we're not fixing your vehicle in the future. So we're not charging you to fix it, all right? Uh, so know that. Uh, you buy this vehicle, you're the owner. Uh, the owner of a hell of a nice car, by the way. This is a beautiful car, but we're not fixing it, okay? It's your car on day one. Um, that being said, I would get in this thing and I would drive it straight to Alaska today. Um, it's a beautiful car. These roads we have are horrific. Look at our, all the bumps and potholes and crap in, in this road. Listen to this thing. This is a big vehicle and it's just not a problem. No vibrations, no noises, nothing. So, 
yeah, this is a hell of a car. Uh, I gotta leave this thing out here for my brother to take photos of. Thank you for your time. All right.